hello friends uh, so let's start with the problem set of algebra for uh, arithmetic progression so here is the question in front of us uh, find t11 from the following ap 4914 so for any uh, maths question first we write the given information so the one that is given to us is the ap ap that is 4 9 14 and so on so for any ap which is given to us by default we know two things from that ap from that ap we know the first term of that ap now here the first term of the ap is 4 so we write 4 here and from the ap we know the common difference now common difference d is given as t2 minus t1 where t2 is the second term and t1 is the first term now the second term here is 9 so we write 9 here and uh, minus and the first term here is 4 so 9 minus 4 is 5 therefore we get the value of d as 5 here we got the value of a and d when the ap is given this is the case in all the ap's now let's see what are we supposed to find we are supposed to find the value of t11 as stated in the question so t11 is equal to question mark let's see the solution here now for finding the value of t11 we have a formula which is given in the textbook the textbook says tn is equals to a plus n minus 1 into d where n can be any number so here we are supposed to find the value of tn when n is equals to 11 so here can you see that n is substituted by 11 so here also in the formula we will substitute n is equals to 11 so we got the value of n as 11 we got the value of d as 5 and we got the value of a as 4 all we have to do is substitute this value in the formula therefore we get t11 is because in place of n i am writing 11 so t11 is equals to 4 plus 11 minus 1 into 5 please note that the sign between these two uh, numbers is multiplication so that will be 4 plus 10 into 5 i'm fine i'm following the board mass rule here so first i'll solve the brackets and then i'll open the brackets first i'll solve multiplication that will be 4 plus 10 into 5 which is that is 50 and then 4 plus 50 that is 54 therefore we got the value of t11 as 54 so i will write the final answer here and i will box it when you box the answer, then it is very easy for the examiner to see the answer and evaluate it.